Hello, hello everyone. Welcome back. It's Mama Wid, and I am here with another box opening. Well, a box opening. The last two were make it reveals. This package actually came from Russia. I ordered it two months ago on eBay, and the artist was afraid that it was lost in transit because uh, the tracking for the USPS only showed leaving Russia. It didn't track anything else. So she actually filed a claim with USPS and the Russian um, Postal Service to find out where it was. I got it two days after it was supposed to be here, but it was okay because you know I didn't receive her. So it's kind of, I've never seen a package like this before. She actually put the box in a pillowcase and tied it with twine with some kind of little metal thing there and a piece of cardboard. So I'm gonna go ahead and try to get this out. I might have to cut this. So I'm going to put you on pause and I'll be back with, with the actual box. Hold on just a few minutes. Live again. Okay, we're back. Yeah, that was about five minutes. We were actually able to get the box out without cutting the, um, the pill case, but it was quite a workout. Thanks to my husband, he got it out. So let's open it up and see what we have. Okay, so we got our protective your bags goes out and more airbags and this I don't what is that this is interesting I guess this is this is the baby I'll put that aside for just a minute let me get everything out of here um, let's see here bag and some more. Okay, that one can stay in there now. Let's move this out of the way. And then we'll put this here. And this here. And um, I'm going to have uh, <laughs> tape. Hold on. I'm going to pause you guys again and take this off and I'll be back. Okay, we're back again. The artist had her very well protected. She had tape all the way around this, so I finally got that off. So, yes, I'm very impressed with her her box so far because it, it was very hard to get into, so it made sure that the doll was not going to get damaged, which is great. Let's see here. And this is a little girl. And you will recognize this one as soon as I show you her face. And oh wow, she even put a box over her head so no rubbing would uh, rub her face for the, the paint. Let's see if I can get this off. Oh goodness. Okay. Oh, let me see. Okay, I'm going to have to pause you again. Hold on. Okay, back again. I was able to get it cut off. So she had her, she has her very well protected. And I'm sure you can see her face now. And I'm sure you know who she is. She is the Sunny Kit. Okay, now where is, oh, she's, her neck is tied. Oh, okay, hold on. Let me see here. Oh my goodness. I'm going to have to cut that too. I'll have to put you on pause again. Hold on. Okay, we're back. I have her all out of her packaging. She was packed amazingly. I've never had a baby packed so well. So now that I've got her out of all her restraints, like I said, as you can see, she is the, let's cut, the Sunny kit and I forgot the artist but I will show you her COA when I get it out get the paperwork out get a good look at her face she has rooted upper eyelashes oh, can't really see there we go um she has an open nose let's take her little bonnet off and see her hair she has rooted hair not quite sure what color it is. Oh, there we go. 
know, a very nice rooting job. And there's her spiral. And oh, she has very, very nice details. I just love her eyelashes and, and her eyebrows and her eyes are very so realistic looking. Okay, let's take a look at her fingers. It's kind of blurry. I don't think it's focusing. She has nice modeling and blushing and veining. She's not too heavy. She has the closed fist. And I do not have a name for this one yet either. And when I do, I will definitely come back on with a name reveal. And let me open up the little package that came with her. There we go. Okay. And then she came with this bag, so I'm thinking that her paperwork is most likely in here. And something else too. So let's take a look. Oh, she has a belly plate. That I did. Oh, that's right. I totally forgot about that. Okay, let's look at the paperwork first. So, like I said, this doll did come from Russia, so I'm not even going to try to read or pronounce any of the names. But I'll show you the COA. So she is the limited edition kit. Nine. Her number is 930 out of... 1550 and she is hand sculpted by here's her sculpting artist here I don't want to butcher it so I'll just show you and then yourself and then this is the artist's uh, looks like birth certificate um, I don't have my glasses on Let's see it's a height 49 centimeters weight 100 and 1600 grams date of birth 2 2 2008 and I don't know if this is coming up I think it's the the glare so yeah I'll come back with another video and show this over again when the lighting's better so there's her paperwork and Here's her painted belly plate. Let's see if I can get this open. Here. Just look at her for a few minutes. Now I have to get this open. <laughs> wow, she loves to use tape. Okay. Okay, here we go. Almost. Okay, there we go. My goodness. Okay, so we have a magnetic passy. Looks like a bunny or a cat, not sure. And then here is her painted belly plate. Very nice details. Very nice work. Very impressed. And she sent home, I think this was in her auction. It's a little, I don't know if this, this isn't crocheted. I'm not sure what these are. They look like they're handmade though. But this is a little, like, overall set. Okay, see that? I'm not sure what it's made out of. So there's that. And... A little bonnet that goes with it. I guess it goes this way. So there's that one. And then she sent a gray one too. Little lacy socks. And a another little bonnet with beads. And this might be knitted, I think. It's got little beads on it. And 
last but not least, another little like romper. Let's see if I can, these are so very thin. So I'll show you, there's the top. It has a little bit of lace going across the top and it's got a lacy tie in the back. And then lace at the bottom. So very nice, very impressed. Very impressed with her. Oh, thank you for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.